This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news, all right? So we're talking about academics versus Tasha K versus, I don't know, there's just so many verses going on here. Tory Lanez versus Meg The Stallion. They were going directly at each other. Uh, so Unwind with Tasha K said, DJ Alvin lying, uh, hiding from uh, dead rappers he reported on. They come in to collect. Now watch your math mouth, Fat Albert. Uh, Shy Town owe you several. You snitch for pay. Leave that woman alone. Worry about these chicks. DM talking about. Oh gosh. So Agnes said, "You bald-headed bird. Pay Cardi, scallywag. You done lied and got exposed. You need the four million. Uh, that me, Cardi B, Offset, Baby Culture can throw it in the strip club. Yes, I'm the bill collector." <laughs> Academics say, where are my hot girls at? Because uh, Meg Thee Stallion was tweeting di- directly at Meg Thee Stallion. Like, I mean, Meg Thee Stallion was tweeting at Academics like, yo, you're lying. Uh, court didn't even start yet. And you're talking about, you know, DNA on a weapon, blah, blah, blah. The Academics says, where's all my hot girls at? Meg, I don't I don't care what you and Tori had, but you don't get to address Big Ack unless you talking about the DNA report said, holla at the DA and figure out what it said. If I lied, I lied. Take me to court. Then, uh, Megan, where's my apology, Megan? Because Nancy Don said, I have the transcript. Uh, we are in the process of actually retaining an expert to respect the DNA. It's our hope that we're able to review and confirm LAPD's analysis from which the standpoint was favorable. Uh, then Melly liked Tori's tweets talking about um, you can't buy and tweet your way out of this one. Not today, Meg. And Melly said, facts are the facts. Melly signed uh, Tory Lanez. She said, facts are facts. But when you're in too deep, the, uh, the act must go on. No evidence, just power, saving face, false narrative. Because Meg really painted Tory. I don't know. This might be, we'll see what happens. This might be bad for Meg. Because really what happened was Tory, I mean, the backstory is Tory was messing with Meg and her best friend, and it got out of hand. They were drunk that night. We Only they know what happened. Uh, he, Meg posted an apology, said, Meg, I know you're probably never going to talk to me again, but I generally wanted you to know I'm sorry from the bottom of my heart, and I was just too drunk. None of these. This doesn't prove anything. Nonetheless, it should have never happened. I can't change what did. I just feel horrible. It could have been an argument or whatever. Something happened. And Meg got injured. That's the way all we know. And Meg said, lie your way out of this one. Uh, if you ain't doing what is apologizing, then lawyers got your phone records and mine. All your texts, they got you recorded on the jail phone talking to Kelsey, apologizing, begging us not to talk. Then she said, uh, F- F2 best friends, you you shot me. You know what's good. Apologizing for you putting uh, uh let's see. You putting something out on me and my friends. Uh, that's not true. Why are you skipping over the shooting? Just admit you shot me because she, I don't know. This shouldn't be playing out on social media. These two are both pretty wrong to be arguing on social media. Then party said, Tori, put the phone down. Let's talk in person. There ain't nothing to talk about. We got to throw hands. Party said, we, uh, that then Tori says, party, we've had this encounter. You did nothing. Put your phone down, big fella. <laughs> oh, this is crazy, bro. Yo, it just makes me feel like everybody's wrong in that car. That's all this stuff makes me feel. Everybody did something wrong in that car. Everybody. Everybody. And someone's got to take the blame. And at that point, Tori was the blame. We'll see how this plays out in court. This will be interesting. Goes back in April. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Smash that like button. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.